right guys I'm back I'm still at the protest we have another what um, 20 minutes yes we know everybody can come out but we can share this and tell us that tomorrow again hello my darling would you like to tell my friends I'm alive tomorrow again you guys are out right yes tomorrow uh -huh. again we're out um, we're going to be here we're going to be standing if it is only a few of us we stand for hundreds of Jamaicans yes. who can't stand with us. Yes. And many more are online yes. expressing their views. And so we will be out here until this thing is settled. Yeah. And we've asked for tabling the documents that they said they have, mm. about the performance measures. Right. Tabling the documents they have about the. Um, job description yeah. we don't we don't know no we don't have no clear idea what right. the job is we have ideas in our heads but what all of that must be in our constitution so we're in a discussion now about reforming our constitution yeah. and this matter that is vexing so much to must go in there yeah, another thing need to change in the constitution. PJ Patterson put in that living prime ministers will receive the wage of the uh, prime minister in the office. Living retired prime ministers would be getting that 20 something million. So that needs to come out. Well, remember the prime minister has said that he's not going to accept So that. they will not be getting they it. Will not be getting it either. Right. Okay. Right. right. And the effect of that decision is to save taxpayers about a hundred and ten million dollars every year. Yes. So Jamaicans should understand that there are outcomes and consequences for these actions. Yes. The Prime Minister would not have stepped back of his salary unless he heard. And he told us, he heard us. He said that he checks at the end of each day all the videos, the memes. Exactly. He even mentioned memes in this serious matter. A meme is a joke. This is not a joke. Yes, and see us. Exactly. And he can roll back his, he can roll back all. Yeah, but don't think about it. It's a collective negotiation or a collective choice. Because remember, you know, the PMP announced... They announced that um, they weren't privy to the figure prior to the announcement. Now, if that is the case, that means that they, the people dealing with it, had considerable time to look at the amounts and say, let us do something different. But they didn't. Yes. So now that they've come forward with their irrational decision and we're saying it cannot work, it should be just the prime minister that steps back from Absolutely. the position. Every single politician can step back. Today we highlighted the fact that the governor general is getting the highest pay. $34 million. Wow. And he's not paying taxes because he's exempt under the yes. tax act. And he also has exemption under the Access to Information Act. So taxpayers who are paying Can't find out. $34 million for his salary and $440 million to run the office will have no access to information wow. about how the money is spent. My word. That's not acceptable. We have to change that. Yes. It's Oh, look how hard we are working for our money. And is that how we want? Is that how we want? Is that how we want to run the country? That is what we have to do. We have to be very thoughtful. Everybody, I see all the security guards, I see the police officers, they're risking their life. And they must still take tax off them. Teachers. That's what I'm saying. They don't get transportation in a lot of these positions. And the government travels, all of them travel on government money. The gas, the plane fare, everything. We, we have to keep standing up. Right? Yes, yes. Stand up. Stand Thank up. you. You have a right to have your voice heard. Yes. Stand up until we can see a more equitable arrangement with respect to pay. That's what it will boil down to. Yes, because we're not just talking about the existing government, the opposition and previous governments and Absolutely. future ones. Absolutely. Jamaicans must remember from 1991, Carl Stone put a, a lot of professionals together and created a, a report, submitted it to the government. This was under the PNP administration. And the recommendation has been sitting. One of the recommendations is to give the Jamaican people the power to recall politicians that are not doing their work. Many countries in the world have, have that. that. Exactly. Exactly. 
can we we don't have the power of recall what we have is the politicians return at very um what should i say now they've served a long tenure whenever they feel like they don't have a retirement age they don't have a recall so they can stay as long as they want doing nothing well you see again this is about the people of jamaica you know because they have the power exactly right? and the question is do you feel you should have that power and if jamaicans resign and accept the status quo they just accept that sort of thing said. it's just gonna get Nothing worse going to it's just gonna get worse my sister this is a moment we have to get our mind yes do you want to continue this arrangement you know the the Minister of Finance told us, you know, he quoted all his Sasso reports and so on. He said there are ad hoc committees that were set up. And he's simply following those ad hoc commissions. <laughs> exactly. exactly. So exactly. why did he not follow the recommendation of, St of Stone and others? Right. To hold others, right. Who are in the space and understand exactly. the space. The so these formulas that were set up years ago, them can't change. Exactly. He's telling we us about... Can. He says, yeah, last night he was... Yeah, exactly and last night he was saying how oh, um this is from 19 such and such but we are in now in 2023 exactly things must change he's upgrading other things are being changed yes and you're upgrading the money so why not update the, 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 the things that govern these things that is where we are now so i applaud you for bringing this to people who are not here so that they here, we're gonna decide where where can people find out tell my viewers it's back now it's back all right so tell them again how they can reach to you advocates net ja and one of my viewers says oxford street which is right up there and surrounding downtown communities is a mess with sewage water everywhere but yet is wage increase them are defend we need to rise up yes speaking of money spent my sister did the prime minister clarify how the money that he says he's not taking will be spent because mark golden said oh 80 percent towards these well, the causes is that mark golden will determine how the 80 percent is set because we'll go into his bank account yes right i don't like that as a response right neither do i it perpetuates, it perpetuates dependence Exa on a person exactly on on a politician or a person we want a system that works exactly Tell my viewers, tell my viewers your name. I'm Rosalie Hamilton and I'm co-chair of the Advocates Network. Yeah, I know already, but I want them to know. Yes, all right. All right. Thank you so much for yes. okay. Roll it back. Roll it back. Broken country. Mama hungry, Papa hungry. Give something for the poor. Broken people. Broken people.
I'm gonna. They were here yesterday, and I'm gonna get them something for the news. For the family life, from Instagram. I'm here as an advocate. Yeah, but I'm with them wicked government here, man. After so much years, I went protest call and a few people show up. And as we say, we know say what, who out here saw and who represent this sentiment. The sentiment bigger than this. This sentiment is worldwide. Every Jamaican upset. I just saw this the news one lady. I said, Andrew Wellness, I love you to my heart. I'm a prime minister, but this way you do a wickedness and it can't work. It cannot work. Highest wages in the English speaking Caribbean. In the English speaking Caribbean, them want to take down the highest wages and uh, give the highest performance and I can't tell about if it attract and new. Economy. Economy now the good way they are second to last when it's scale yeah. in the Caribbean. Yeah. We are second yeah, to last. Here to the back of the I'm